Hi and welcome to the Tinkering Seal. Today I'm going to show you a Meisterstück that was never sold by Mont Blanc. This one here is the 19th anniversary special edition of the Meisterstück line. It was released back in 2014 and was only available in the classic line, giving the 145 fountain pen, the 163 rollerball and the 164 ballpoint. Now, I use a pencil very much in work, so I always missed the 165 mechanical pencil in this version. So I made it myself. This 165 you see before you began its life as a 164 ballpoint. Now the interior is different, but the exterior are identical. So I'm going to show you how to make one by using the 2016 released Ultra Black. So we remove this one and we bring in the Ultra Black ballpoint. Now before you start to disassemble, remember there's a spring in here that might shoot the parts away if you're not holding them down when you disassemble. So first you take the top cap and unscrew it. This holds down the clip, so make sure you don't drop the clip when doing this. There, the clip is free and also the cap. Here's the twist mechanism unscrews from the barrel and you also have the ink. Now to release the spring I usually take a paper clip and wiggle because they're a bit stuck. And there we go, the spring is free. So let's remove the ballpoint parts and bring in the pencil parts. First you have the interior barrel that holds the leads. You have the pencil twist mechanism and you have the pencil interior cap top. To assemble start with taking the twist mechanism and put it inside the top cap. It goes quite a bit down and then place the mechanism inside the cap. By holding down you can take the clip and you see there's a little tab here that goes on the long clip side to keep it in one place. And then screw the cap top back on make everything stay in place. Make it nice and tight. Next we take the barrel and we take the interior barrel, put it inside. You can see the tip is coming out and this is static on the mechanical pencil. That's why we need to remove the spring from the ball point. And just like the ballpoint, we screw the cap back on into the barrel. Here, click. That's when you initiate the uh, twist mechanism for the pencil. This is the propelling mechanism. So you twist back and forth and you can see the leads coming out. So there we have it, a 165 Ultra Black. Now the reason why there's an interior cap top is because you remove the cap to get to the eraser. It just slides on. Now this modification is possible on all the classic ball points and classic mechanical pencils but also on the Meisterstück Mozart, the baby Meisterstück. The way of doing it is basically the same. You unscrew the top to release the clip and the cap. Here's the clip. 
And there's the cap. Inside you find the twist mechanism, but also an interior cap top, even though it's a ballpoint. This is because the Mozart uses a different ink system compared to the classic line. So this cap top part, it's identical to the pencil system. Unscrew the twist mechanism. And again, different kind of ink cartridge, so there's no spring in the end of the barrel. And here's the refill. So let's remove the twist mechanism for the ballpoint and bring in the twist mechanism for the pencil along with the inner barrel for the pencil. Since this is identical, we can reuse this for the pencil. Just stick it back on top. And to make it easier, we assemble the twist mechanism to the barrel. Again, you can see the tip pointing out. This is static since it's a pencil and as on the classic line, it's a twist mechanism. Put the cap back on and the clip. And again, a little tab here to navigate the clip into the right position and to keep it in place. And put the top back on, screw it back on. There we go. And so, now we turned it into a 117R, a mechanical pencil Mozart. So what about the big Meisterstück, the Le Grand? Here we have a 167 Le Grand propelling pencil. Note that this is not a mechanical pencil because the system to extract the lead is different. This is a propelling, so you just keep turning the cap and the lead extends further and further. You don't get to a clicking stop like you do with the Mozart and the classic. Now this is a 0.9 millimeter lead, so it's rather thick. Uh, you are unable to do the transformation on these pens uh, because the tip is different compared to the ballpoint. Both in the Mozart and in the classic versions, the tip of the barrel is the same. But here the tip is adapted to the 0.9 millimeter lead instead of the dimension of a ballpoint. So you will need to replace the whole barrel to be able to do the convers conversion of a uh, Legrand. And just see the massive difference in size between these two. So, there we have it. A 165 Ultra Black and a 165 19th anniversary of the Meisterstück line. So, thank you all for watching, hit the like if you liked the video, comment what you think down below and hit the subscribe and don't forget the little bell icon so you get notifications each time I publish something new. Take care everyone, bye bye.